Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to see how to fix fit gallery packs. GTA 5 the core execution cannot pursued because Steam API 64.dll was not found. Let's fix it guys. Go to search now and type Windows Security. Click on open it. On left side select virus threat protection. Select manage settings under virus and threat protection settings. Turn off everything in this page. After turning off, go back to virus and threat protection and select protection history under current threats. And in here you can able to see lots of things listed. Under here you can able to see threat quarantined. Click on it and select yes. And if you see GTA 5 related game file is listed over here. Then you just need to click on the drop down in action and select restore option and this file will be restored guys the same thing for other things listed you just need to click on it one by one in thread quarantine in my case i already restored the missing dll files as you can see thread restored in your case this will be listed as thread quarantine just click on it and you can able to see GTA 5 path. Click on the action and select restore option. Do the same thing for all the things listed over here. Make sure you restored every GTA 5 files in this list. After doing it, you just need to go to search menu and type register editor. Click on open it and select yes. And check my video description for this registry path. Just to copy and paste it and press enter. On right side, you just need to create a value guys. Just right click and select the new and select the devote 32 bit value. And check my video description for this text just to copy and just rename this value we created. Just right click and select rename and paste the text. Just press enter and double click on this and set this value data to 1 and click on OK and just close stuff here. This step will prevent this error in further guys. Now you just need to go ahead and restart your PC. After restarting your PC, you can play GTA 5 without having any problem. And you will never face these kind of errors in GTA 5 anymore. Don't forget to leave a like guys. Thank you.